This way. Big brother? He's my brother! We're your family. I'm so sorry, everyone. I feel like I have no choice but to... Sorry, big brother. I've made my decision. How could you? You're giving up on us and battling completely unknown opponents. They look tough. Not a problem for my big brother. The Otto Blade is taking on a form I've never seen. Ooh, that looks painful. He's using Dragon Fang! The power of the first dragon. Wow, he's really mastered it, hasn't he? What did you expect? Are those warriors of the Outrealms? Not to worry. Leave some for me. Big Brother's now Big Sister. Wow! Even better! I've decided. My path is to take on the legendary Heroes of Smash! I'm Masahiro Sakurai from Sora Limited, the director of Super Smash Bros. Thank you for waiting. This will be the last video presentation of Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS and Wii U. I hope you'll enjoy this finale. The main character from Fire Emblem Fates, Korin, will be joining the fight. As we developed new fighters, we thought to include someone from this upcoming game. That's how we decided to begin production on Korin. It's been a while since the new Fire Emblem title launched in Japan, but we're now just a couple months away from launching it in the rest of the world, so you'll get a chance to become familiar with Korin before you play the game. As with Wii Fit Trainer and Robin, you can choose to play as a male or female version of Korin. Both perform exactly the same, so it's all up to personal preference. You may notice the sword in Korin's hand. It's the final form of the weapon Yato, called Omega Yato. However, that is not his primary way of fighting. Korin has the blood of a dragon in his veins, and this lets him transform. This ability allows him to pull off attacks that no other fighter can. He's capable of changing entirely into a dragon, but some of his moves transform only some parts of his body. His side smash attack has tremendous reach. The tip of this attack is especially powerful, so consider how far you are from your opponent when you use it. When using back air attacks, Korin briefly sprouts wings. He moves forward when his wings appear, which may just give you the extra boost you need when recovering. After activating a dragon attack, his head changes in appearance. Korin's standard special can be charged up by pressing and holding the B button, the Dragon Fang Shot. If you land it, your opponent will be paralyzed for a bit. After firing, the transformed hand can also bite a nearby opponent. This follow-up attack can also be charged by holding the B button. This combo deals a lot of damage and can really launch a foe. Korin's side special is a jump followed by a low thrust to the side, the Dragon Lunge. 
But this is not just a simple thrust. If you can stick your weapon in the ground successfully, you can remain hanging where you are. You can even pin your foe in place with this move. After pinning them, you can use a front kick, back kick, jump, or cancel. Pin your opponent, then decide what to do based on the situation. The up special puts Korin's wings to work, Dragon Ascent. At full wingspan, Korin has a wide attack range. You can control the angle for a wider attack too. Use it wisely. Korin's down special attack is Counter Surge. It's a counter move familiar to fans of the Fire Emblem fighters. One big difference is a visual one, the Dragon Transformation. Look carefully and you can see that the opponent's attack doesn't reach you. Other differences include being able to launch opponents upward and attack left and right equally. Corrin's final smash is Torrential Roar. You can pull in several nearby opponents with a whirl of water and then finish them off all at once. There is no exclusive stage for this new fighter. What about new music then, you say? Yes, if you purchase Corin for the Wii U version, you can get two additional music tracks for free. The first one is the Fire Emblem Fates theme song, Lost in Thoughts All Alone. It includes vocals. The other is a remixed version of the same song we played in the new Challenger video earlier. Both songs will be added to the existing Fire Emblem stages, so you can adjust the odds of them playing in my music. In the Nintendo 3DS version, as a special bonus, we added trophies of Ryoma and Xander from Fire Emblem Fates. They are the eldest brothers from the Hoshido and Nor kingdoms, respectively. Korin's new Challenger illustration was created by Yusuke Kozaki, who is taking care of character designs for Fire Emblem Fates. This is his second Challenger illustration. His first was for Robin. Please check it out on the official website. We're targeting a February 2016 release for Corrin. We will announce the exact date later on the official website.